Today I'm going to talk to you about a few ways to clean your pixie cup while you're using it and also how to sterilize your pixie cup at the end of your period. So the first way to clean your cup as you're using it is with this pixie cup wash. It's a pH balanced, all natural ingredients, plant based, biodegradable, preservative, mineral oil and artificial color free wash and it's a foam wash and it smells so great. It's citrusy but it's not an overwhelming fragrance. This you would use after you take your cup out with clean hands always. You take your cup out and then spray a couple of pumps of this on your cup, give it a good lather and then rinse it off. And I would probably use this one to two times a day just to make sure that your cup is super clean because you never want a dirty cup for any reason. So this is a great investment for something you can keep at home in your shower or by your sink, somewhere where you're changing your cup most frequently. I would use the Pixie Cup Wash. If you're in a situation that you can't be by your sink or in your shower, they also have the Pixie Cup wipes, which are the perfect size to put inside your purse. I leave these in my purse at all times. I've had to use them a couple times. And you would just, again, clean your hands before taking your cup out. Always, always, always make sure that your hands are super clean before removing your cup. You'd remove your cup and then you would get a wipe and wipe the inside and outside of your pixie cup with the wipe wipe your hand off and then toss the wipe these again are so convenient if you cannot change your cup in the comfort of your own home or if maybe you're just in a hurry these are a great alternative so it's super crucial that you make sure that you are giving your cup a good wash a couple times a day as you're on your period when it comes to the end of your period there's a couple different ways to sterilize your cup the first way that I learned was to simply boil a pot of water on the stove and then drop your cup in there and then let it boil for three to five minutes. The reason why I don't love this method is because you have to keep an eye on your cup. You want to make sure that your cup doesn't touch the bottom of the pot or it can damage the silicone. So that's the one thing with that method that I would note. And two other methods that I was able to try this last period were the pixie cup cup this is great it is compact i have it popped open but it also closes and what you do with this is you would boil water on the stove put it inside of the pixie cup cup you would then take your cup drop it inside seal it with the lid and then leave it on your countertop to sterilize for a few minutes this is so easy also, it's nice because you can travel with this very easy. So if you're staying somewhere else or maybe on vacation, this is a great alternative. Also, you don't have to have boiling water from the stove. You can simply fill this up with water and then pop it in your microwave and bring the water to a boil that way. This next method is my personal favorite way of sterilizing my Pixie Cup. And again, I got to try it just this last period and I am obsessed. So it's this little guy, which is the Pixie Cup Steamer. And what you do with this is you take the top off of this, and then on the back there's a five milliliter line. You can't see it, but it's down here. So you'd fill it up with water to the five milliliter line. You would then take the base and the water, pour the water into the center of the base. Then you would take your cup and set it on the center just like this. Take the cover, put it on, and then plug it in. Once you plug it in, it automatically kicks on and starts steaming your cup. You can walk away for 20 minutes because this also turns off when it's done sterilizing and come back and your cup is perfectly clean. This was so great because I didn't have to stand over the pot and make sure it wasn't touching the bottom and I could literally just stick my cup in here and forget about it. So again, the methods are for cleaning your cup in between uses are using the foaming wash and or using a pixie cup wipe and then for sterilizing it at the end of your period you can use the pixie cup cup the pixie cup steamer or you can just boil a pot of water on the stove as well but it's super important that we take good care of our cups because that makes it so that our cups will last up to 10 years if we're taking really good care and making sure we sterilize them it also helps to prevent staining so hopefully these tips are helpful so you can keep your cup in the best shape. 